Sea Grants had a long relationship with the Environmental Studies Center. We've been part of Sea Grant education programs for over 20 years. And because the public school system, our budget from the public school is very small and goes to programming for students, Sea Grant allows us to have an intern here with maintaining exhibits. It helps us get supplies, food for these exhibits, and all these exhibit animals become part of our education program. And we use these animals to be the ambassadors to teach the future citizens of the coastal area how important coastal habitat is, uh, the dangers of habitat loss, uh, resiliency, what to do after a storm, how wildlife cope and adapt. So it really has a huge impact on the education, environmental education of the students of Mobile County and the Gulf Coast. We're at the Marine Education Center, which is the education and outreach arm of the Gulf Coast Research Lab of University of Southern Mississippi. Our K-12 students come for one or two day programs to do educational experiences outdoors. A new program that we offer is this collaboration with the Shark Lab at Gulf Coast Research Lab to participate in their tag and release program. And that is a really popular experience. We move the emphasis towards sharks and look at shark biology, shark anatomy, sharks. including their different fins, dorsal fin, pectoral fin, all of the different um, structures around their snout and their mouth, especially their teeth, because of course everybody is most interested in their teeth. And luckily we have many um, examples of shark jaws. And there's an awful lot that's particularly interesting about sharks, so it's turned out to be something that's really fascinating for the general public. And, and these are very popular programs. 